So I thought I'd get this on the video, a view of the mountains off in the distance. I'm back up on Liberty Ridge or Liberty Mountain and there's Liberty University down below. Uh, I'm hoping to get in some uh, new trails today. Uh, we'll talk about things uh, on the trail. Uh, I got the dead cat. <laughs> Everybody's complained about the sound quality on my videos, but uh, so with the dead cat. And by the way, I today I at least I, I got got the walking stick. I'm not going to be stupid. And uh, let's just get on the trails. And uh, I'm going to go over to the trail sign, and that'll be the next clip. So this will be my last uh, video about Liberty Mountain. And I kind of wanted to show you uh, all the crazy stuff we've done. Um, we've done Dirty Ridge, which was right here. Uh, I've been on Deer Trail. Uh, don't think we've been on Oaks Way. Um, I don't know about Idiot's Run. That, that would be a good one if I could try to get it in today. Um, so we are right here. Now we've done Fallwell Road. We, that was, and of course we did the Lake Trail. That was kind of nice. Uh, and then of course we did the trail too far. So this is a restricted area, Gun Range Road. Uh, that boy would like to go out there and see if I could shoot some of my guns, but I don't know. Uh, and then we came over here and we did, uh, well, I can't, I'm looking for it. To, uh, well, I'd like to do this uh, split fork road. Uh, that would be fun, um, but we never got that in. A walk in the park, I don't think we've done. And split decision looked like a good one right here. Um, so I guess, uh, you know, since I'm right here at the Snowflex, because I can't park in the lower parking lot, because after 5 o'clock, I think they they would get to me. And, of course, we've been down Monogram Road the whole way, all the way up to the, uh, the uh, 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 well, I guess the, the gazebo on top of the mountain there, where uh, Jerry Falwell was the last day before he died. So I guess uh, what I'm going to try to do is just kind of dive down in here and uh, and then make, uh, well, here's cut and pass. I'm trying to see what I want to do. Maybe come, well, we've done Raccoon Alley. Here's Great Escape. We've done that. But I got to get over to here. I want to get over to Oaks Way. Um, so I guess, uh, well, I, I'm trying to see this Champion Road. We've been down that. Anyway, so I'm going to try to get over to Oaks Way today, and that'll be uh, the next way, uh, the next video. Um, by the way, my yard service, uh, you know, this is Hideaway, H-Y-D-A-W-A-Y. My new yard service, Appalachian uh, Lawn Service for here in Lynchburg, uh, they actually live on Hideaway Road. <laughs> I was like, son of a gun, it's a small world after all. Now I could, well, I guess I could go down Monogram Road. And then, well, I, we just did Horton's Loop. Remember that? I think that was what we did. And of course, Psychopath, we've been on that. So anyway, I, I'm going to try to get over here to uh, these trails. And let's see how it goes. I'm just trying to show you Liberty Mountain from, from beginning to end. And this will be the last video of, of this series uh, on Liberty Mountain. Uh, I'll talk to you soon. You know, I just marvel at the amazing things that we can create in the human race. I mean, look at this monster. I mean, it looks like something out of a science fiction movie, and it's just a, a piece of John Deere equipment. Look at those tracks. I mean, you know, when you think about the tanks and everything, I mean, anyway, I'm just on my way to Idiot's Run here at Liberty University or Liberty Mountain or whatever you want to call it, but I just thought I'd get this on the video. All right. So as I come down Monogram Road, we've already been, this is 1971, we've been up that trail, uh, made a video about that, and uh, right now we're looking for Idiot's Run, and we've been, we've been up this trail, um, so I'll just keep continuing down Monogram Road, but I thought I'd just show you, I mean, this is the time of year to be in Lynchburg, Virginia, look at how beautiful it is. I mean, the trees have bloomed, the leaves are coming out, uh, the temperature is outstanding, uh, there's no humidity, and, uh, and then of course I'm coming up, we've already done this one, that's peak to peak right there, that'll take you up to the gazebo on top of the mountain, but I just thought I'd just uh, kind of show you, because I, 
I hate the fact that I'm just hiking down a road and I, I've already done all these trails. And so we're trying to get the Idiot's Run, which is one that we have not done. And that should be interesting. Uh, but it's going to be a long hike and man, it's a little bit late start. It's about four, get, getting to be four o'clock in the afternoon. And uh, I don't know. I don't know if I'll get it in today. But uh, let's see. Let's see what happens. And uh, by the way, I did talk to uh, the Snowflex to see if I can get an interview about Liberty University and uh, the history of the Snowflex um, that, uh, that's here for... And I, they did say, I think it's open to the public. And so, uh, you know, if you want to go uh, snow skiing in the middle of the summer, sounds like you could. Anyway, let's just keep going until I get that interview. I, I don't know. So not having a map along, <clears throat> this is uh, peak to peak going that way. And of course we got 1971 and we've done both of those. And then of course this trail goes up to the uh, gazebo. So I'm just, you know, I'm, I'm just gonna kind of head down. This is, uh, let's see, I can't remember the name of it. Uh, hold on. So this is uh, um, Champion Road when we've done that. So I'm just gonna hike down here and make every left that I can think of uh, and just try to get over to idiots run um, but man isn't it beautiful here today I mean wow this is this is what you live for people this is freedom this this is what it's like all right so let's keep going I'm, I'm gonna this is gate five here right off of monogram road like I said we could hike that trail and go up to the gazebo let's just go on down and see if we can find a left and get over to idiots run so I have shown you this in past videos, and uh, but I, you hadn't seen it with all the leaves on the trees. You know, if you just want to come to Liberty Mountain and do an easy hike, uh, just come down Champion Road here, you know, come down Monogram to Champion and just do this. Um, I'm hoping to get into uh, some craziness at some point, but, uh, and, but the problem is it is all downhill. Uh, so that means in the end you're going to be <laughs> you're going to be hiking uphill all the way back, which is always a problem for me because I I tend to do too much and then I have a hard time getting back to my car and man when I get home it's a, it's always a beautiful experience but I did want to kind of show you I mean you know in this uh, this is astounding and of course I'm out here all by myself you know there's nobody around um, you know if you're worried that COVID's or the CCP virus is going to blow in off of the trees and you know this is this is an activity that you can do here in Lynchburg Virginia and just hike down Champion Road easy hike uh, I'm enjoying it um, so let's hope we get to Idiot's Run I'm gonna get I'm gonna give it a try today but I got a late start I had to go uh, take care of some financial stuff with Aflac uh, and I can only use the fax machine at the um, the, well, I call it a nursing home, but the resort where my mom is, and and uh, and so that's that's kind of where the day went, and so that's why I'm out here so late. But you can see the sun; it's it's uh, pretty high up in the sky, so I think we got some time. Well, let's just keep going. So as I come down Champion Road, there's an alternate flight pattern going off to the left, and of course you could go up this way to the well. That's to the left. Um, just showing you, and we, we've hiked these trails. Let's keep going. So here goes alternate flight pattern again off of Champion Road, and it's, believe it or not, that's a trail there. Uh, I think we might have hiked that at some point. Um, I'm going to keep on Champion Road, and uh, it looks like there's another uh, sign down here. Let's see what that's about, and maybe that'll be the left that we need to take to try to get over to Idiot's Run. That's our goal today, to get over to Idiot's Run, because that's a trail we have not hiked. Boy, I guess I've been hiking around back here <laughs> quite a bit. This is a uh, psychopath, which is going to take you up to the gazebo if you want to go up there. And man, it is a psychopath. And of course, here's Champion Road. And then, of course, down here, I won't show it on the video because uh, psychopath dives back into the woods. Um, so I guess we're just going to have to keep going and we got to find a left turn at some point. Let's see where we go. Okay, so just down from psychopath. I came to alternate flight pattern again, and uh, let's give it a try. I know that I haven't taken this trail here, and rather than stay on Champion Road and just keep going, let's uh, let's go this way and see uh, if I can run into uh, Idiot's Run. 
So I thought I'd just get a quick uh, clip of alternate flight pattern. I mean, the, the footing is treacherous. You should bring a walking stick. Uh, um, I'm moving slowly. Um, I mean, you're, you're back here in the woods. You get the feeling that, you know, that uh, you're, you're off the grid for sure. And uh, I'm enjoying it. I'm enjoying the hike. I'm hoping this will run into something. Well, idiots run. That's what we're seeking out today. All right, so I just wanted to show you what the trail looks like because you can see, I mean, if this was wet, you could slip on these roots or these rocks, uh, you know, so you gotta, you gotta kind of look at where you're placing your feet. And I'm moving a bit slow at this point. I can't hike very fast, but it is quite beautiful, quite beautiful, especially this time of the year. Absolutely outstanding. So I'm tempted to get back on Champion Road because you can see alternate flight pattern. It's, it, it's kind of, at this first point, it's a nothing burger of a trail because uh, we're just kind of moving next to the uh, Champion Road and probably getting ticks on me. Um, I don't know. Uh, I, I would have preferred that it go up and down the mountain or do something, but we'll see. We'll, we'll continue on it and see what happens. Well, looky here. All of a sudden, alternate flight pattern is hidden down the mountain, big time. So I think we're uh, we're in store for a hell of a hike here. I, I, I this is going to be uh, this is going to be interesting. Um, we are way off a of Champion Road at this point. I'm enjoying it. Uh, you can see the forest. I uh, got to keep checking for ticks, uh, but I don't think they're probably out at this time of the year. They could be. Um, but man, we are going we are going down into the forest at this point. Woohoo! So for anybody watching this videos, uh, I'm at K10. Luckily there's an emergency number there, but I don't have my cell phone with me. And I'm gonna tell you, it's gonna be a brutal hike back up. I mean, we are going down. Uh, I gotta take it nice and slow because these rocks can roll out from underneath your feet, but I got the walking stick and uh, I don't know where we're going. That's, that's why we do these hikes. It's the adventure, people. It's the adventure. Freedom! Oh, freedom! So I thought I'd get that on the video. I mean, I think it looks pretty cool, doesn't it? And uh, we're still going down the mountain. I mean, just kind of look around. You know, I mean, uh, you know, you, you have a heart attack back here, get bit by a snake. <laughs> Ain't nobody going to find you. <laughs> I guarantee, dag on to you, I will not see another living human being on this trail. But uh, I, I'm still going down. Now, I, I, I hate to say it. I mean, going up is more difficult, but it's a lot easier hiking than going down. Um, so, yeah, and it will get my heart rate up. Maybe I'll have that heart attack and somebody will just find this video and say, well, this is the last one that cybersecurity guy ever did. Uh, but look at that. Isn't that beautiful? I mean, we are way back here at this point. I, I wasn't the hike I had planned. I mean, I wanted to do idiots run. Maybe we'll come across that. But at some point I got to turn around and, and get back to the car. It's going to get dark on me. All right. So let's keep going. So I'm still hiking along here at the bottom of the valley. Another uh, EV thing for the uh, ROTC. Um, very, I mean, if you, if you wanted to do this hike, I'm, I'm really enjoying it. I'm not going to enjoy going back up the mountain, but uh, you can kind of see. I mean, there looks like there's a creek over here. Uh, uh, the ferns are coming in. I mean, isn't that quite beautiful? Um, I tell you, it's... Uh, it's a great hike. It's a great hike. I'm, I'm enjoying it very much. I wish I was moving faster. I'm just, I'm just kind of exhausted at this point. And uh, I've been, once I get to the end of this uh, Oak Run Trail, I, we won't get idiots run in today, unfortunately. And then I'm going to start working my way back to the car, probably on Champions Road. And of course, we won't get any video of that because you've already seen that. But look, look up the mountain here. Isn't that, isn't that amazing? You know, and you, you're not going to see anybody back here. <laughs> you're all by yourself. You know, I mean, if you want to get back in the woods and just do a, a well, so far an easy hike uh, other than coming down the mountain. Um, and of course, at some point I got to go back up the mountain. Um, but yeah, this, this Oaks Trail is, uh, is, is, is quite, uh, quite the nice hike. And uh, especially this time of the year when the temperature is just perfect. And I can't wait to get up on the parkway. I'd like to try Flat Top Mountain. Now, I, last time I attempted it, I only got halfway up it and I had to turn around because I'm fat old dude. 
But I tell you, it's good exercise. And uh, I, I, I remember as a kid, I actually hiked a 60 pound backpack up that mountain and camped out on top of it, which is illegal, but you know, catch me if you can. Who, what ranger was gonna hike up the mountain to, to see me on top of the mountain? And actually it was pretty doggone scary. There was bobcats screaming and all kinds of crazy. I mean, that's, the, that's another thing I wanted to comment on. I mean, look around. I don't, I'm not seeing, I've been on this hike for a couple hours now. Not a single deer. Not a snake. I mean, not a bird. I mean, there's no wildlife today. Um, and you know, I love getting that on the video, but I mean, there's really just nothing to, it's a nothing burger as far as the wildlife. I mean, where's all the wildlife back here? I mean, I, I guess I do make a lot of noise as I'm, I march along here, but still you'd think I'd see something, but nothing so far people. All right. So it wasn't the video that I intended to make, but look at here, you know, so you're basically just hiking along a valley at uh, Oak Run. I thought we were going to get idiots way in, but anyway, I, this is, this is good enough for me. I'm enjoying it. I mean, you can kind of see, uh, it's quite beautiful. I mean, and it's a, it's actually a very uh, easy hike. I'm enjoying it very much. Um, but I did want to get the creek in on on the video because that's what's basically you're just kind of hiking next to a creek and it's a somewhat level trail so but I, yeah at some point I, it's going to make a right at some point and i got to get back up to champions road and that'll be it for the video um you know so uh and have i needed the walking stick yeah per se but mud and like psychopath or <laughs> some of them other trails that we've done on liberty mountain those were a lot more difficult than this but who knows i mean when i go back up the champion road which is i imagine what i'm gonna have to do at some point uh it could get it could get treacherous well let's just keep enjoying the, the view and boy i love the ferns coming in isn't that amazing you know i i just love love being back here look i mean look at that look at that i mean that's i mean i what 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 can you do in life that's better than this? Uh, you tell me. I mean, I, I, well, maybe racquetball. I love racquetball. I wish I could play again. Maybe when I get back to Florida, I'll try to find some sort of racquetball. But looks like it's a dying sport. Everybody's gone to pickleball these days, which is okay. You know, whatever. Well, looky here. We came to split decision, and we've talked about that trail. And then of course Oaks Way is gonna continue in that direction. And then let's see what this bridge leads us to. There's another trail over here. Um, I wonder if this is, I don't know what this is. Maybe this is what I've done in the past. So this is uh, killer bees. <laughs> I'm not doing killer bees today. I mean, but that would be a fun trail to do probably, um, you know. But I, I'm, I'm kind of just got to head back to the car at this point. And um, so I'm going to make a right right here and tr try to head back up the mountain uh, as much as I want to continue on Oaks Way. Because look at it. It's a very, very great uh, hike. Um, I'm just I'm just tired today. I'm, I, I don't know. I just don't have the energy. So let's let's go to the right here and start working our way back to the car. I'll let you know what I see along the way. So this is what I told you, that what goes down comes up. And this is gonna to be tough hiking, and this is where a walking stick is gonna come in. I mean, look at it. Look at what I'm coming up. And uh, so it's gonna be, uh, I gotta be careful, and that's why the, this is gonna be slow going. I thought I'd just get a quick clip. Woo, the heart rate is up. You can see I'm climbing up the mountain. And uh, man, that's, uh, I'm feeling it. I'm feeling it. I mean, who knows? Maybe I'll have a heart attack before I get to the top of this trail. But look at it. I mean, it's, uh, I don't even know the name of the trail at this point. <laughs> I, just, I just knew it was going off to the right and this should be working me back towards the car. And I knew I had to climb back up the mountain at some point. But anyway, let's keep going. So at least now I know I'm on a trail. M12, wherever the hell M12 is. Whew. Oh man, I hate climbing up when I'm tired. All right, let's just keep going up the mountain. So don't tell me women in combat don't mix. 
a woman just passed me going mountain biking this trail. <laughs> I, I can barely hike the damn thing. I mean, my God, I can't imagine riding a bike down this stupid thing. And I just stepped off to the side and let her go. And I said the word, respect, respect. So this is not good. Trail's going back down. And I'm pretty sure Champion Road is up there somewhere. I don't know, all I could do is just keep going at this point. This is one of the, I mean, it's the beauty of hiking and the curse of hiking. <coughs> Man, that pollen's getting to me. So believe it or not, I passed two more back mountain bikers going down the mountain. Man, I tell you, heck, more power to them. But I think I'm coming up to the end of the hike. We'll do the uh, mantra, when and if I know that I'm at the end of this journey. Whew, I'm just glad to be up the mountain. I knew, well, Doc says I gotta get the heart rate up. I got the heart rate up, Doc. Hope you watch these videos occasionally. But I think we're coming into Champion Road and that'll be it for, for this video. All right, so I was right. We were on split decision. So we did a little, another portion of that trail. Uh, I don't remember, I don't think we've done that. I'm just gonna hike up Champion Road and go back to the car. So let's do the, uh, the mantra at this point, because I am back to where I know where I'm at. Freedom, oh freedom. Someday I will be back in the free state of Florida where we have uh, no, uh, no mandates, no, uh, no uh, ministry of truth. Um, none of those things. Uh, we are free to come and do as we please in Florida. And I guess I'm going to have to work on the mantra because the world keeps changing. It looks like uh, even the, that idiot Fachi may have said, uh, actually he did say it. He said that uh, we're done with um, the CCP virus at this point. No, it's going to come back. It's just like the flu. You're going to see it again. So, you know, I'll get back to the mantra on that. You guys, uh, peace out. Stay free, and if you're a Democrat, be sure and go to California, New York, or uh, any of these Democrat states. Stay the hell out of Florida. Bye. So I just thought I'd add one last little clip to the video as I hike down Champion Road back to the car. Just heard on the radio. <laughs> these leftist lunatics in Oregon are going to put tampons in the, the men's bathroom. I, I bet that's going to work out well. I, I have a feeling that there's going to be some stopped up toilets uh, from those tampons in the men's bathroom. Uh, what say you? You want to leave a comment below? I, I, I just, I, I, it just seems like that the, the absurdity of the world just continues along. All right, so I wanted to summarize the hike today. So we started from the Snowflex. We came down Monogram Road. We hit Champion here. And then we hit alternate flight pattern, which took us down the mountain. And then, uh, of course, we've already done Horton's Loop. And uh, so then we hit, we hit Oaks Way, came around Oaks Way, and I could have kept going. I would have loved to have gone all the way up to here, but instead I was too tired. So we have hit alternate, well, split decision. So here's split decision. We didn't do this portion, but we just hit split decision to come back up to Champion Road. And then, of course, I hiked back um to the car so there you go uh, now i look at let's see where we to get over to idiots run well i guess someday you could come down well you could just take uh well take champion road all the way down to split decision and then just come out this way to get the idiots run and then follow that all the way back over to the other well actually whoa Okay, it looks like we could hit Idiot's Run at the other parking lot. That's the other parking lot right there. That's where we got on uh, Horton's Loop. Okay, so maybe uh, maybe we'll get back out and hit Idiot's Run on the other parking lot at the at the lower area. All right, peace out. Stay free. I mean, I, man, I got a I got a huge hike back up the mountain to, to get back to my car. But man, what a beautiful day. It's, uh, it's, well, it was 89 degrees when I started out. I imagine the temperature's probably around 85 at this point. No humidity whatsoever. And just enjoying the hike. I, I, I wish I was going faster, but I've just been, I, I've had too much mental uh, stress. 
you know, dealing with my mom and her hating on me and, you know, and, uh, and dealing with everything. And, uh, you know, that's why I get out and hike. And that's what I encourage you to do. You know, this is why you get out, people. You got to get out in the forest and just, well, you get you thinking about things and just get your mind, get you away from it all. You know, that's the key. At some point, you have to take a break. Otherwise, you're going to be a drug addict or an alcoholic or whatever. You know, I don't, I, I, I couldn't tell you. I mean, I, I, I just know this is therapeutic for me. Um, so, anyway, uh, that's it. Uh, th th I'll post this clip as a separate video. This will be a nice uh, uh, short clip. I'm trying to think if there's anything else that I wanted to talk about. I guess we could do the, the Russia, Russia, Russia thing. Um, you know, I... Uh, any, I don't know. I mean, there's just, there's too much going on. I mean, I, the Ministry of Truth, who would have ever thought something like that? I mean, the Democrats have lost their gosh dang minds. But anyway, I'm, I'm glad to be here. Look at that tree. Look at that massive tree right there. Wow. All right. So this will be a separate video and I'll just throw this one up. I won't take, look at this tree. I mean, this is what I'm seeing out here. I mean, is this the new Green Deal? You tell me. Leave a comment below.